Hi there! Welcome to my channel, The Greatest Experiment of All. Today I want to kickstart my mini-series about famous women in science because I'm a woman in science and I find these women very fascinating, very inspiring, and I hope that through this series you'll actually be inspired to look up more information about these women and their contributions to our society. So to get started, I want to talk about Maria Marian. She was a famous entomologist, and it's actually believed she became an entomologist because when her mother was pregnant with her, she went to a bug collection, and apparently they thought it kind of seeded the ideas in her. Yeah. Uh, to go along with our bug theme here um, is our next famous scientist, and she's actually a Navy admiral and a computer scientist, and that's Grace Hopper. She coined the term debugging whenever a moth flew into her computer system and she had to like get it out. I think that's really cool, I had no idea. And she even created the very first complex computer language called COBOL. And um, another cool and interesting thing about her and something that I felt was really inspiring is that in her office she kept a clock that actually went the opposite way. It ticked backwards and that was to tell her and teach her every day to remind her that hey, things don't just have to work one way and they're still useful. So I thought that that was especially inspiring about her. Our third one is Jane Goodall and she, as you may know, is a famous anthropologist and primatologist and I thought it was really special that she still keeps her toy monkey she had when she was a little girl. And I think that's just so cute and it just goes to show that, you know, we're all still children at heart and we may be famous scientists or, well, not me, they are, but you know, they may be famous scientists, but they're still people and they're still women and, you know, they have these special little quirks about them. And another cool fact about Jane Goodall, before I forget, is that Tarzan actually inspired her to go to Africa. And I absolutely adore Tarzan, the, um, the original Disney movie. Not really the new one, but that's a whole different story. Um, anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this first video in the series, and I hope that you'll come back next time. Until then, much love from me.